Okay, just before this video starts, I want to show you guys some freaking Pathfinder's fan art. Oh my god, I mean, just look at this thing. Pure quality perfection, man. That's what, I, that's what I'm going to call this masterpiece. And guess who made it? Freaking Skell. <laughs> oh my god. And if you guys don't know what this is, this is pretty much my character that I play in like those in real life videos or sub milestone videos and one is going to come when we reach 10k on this channel which is going to be kind of fast i didn't even expect it to be this fast but jesus christ man you guys are just destroying the subs my god and i do really appreciate each and every one of you man i mean 10k was just like my my freaking sub goal of dreams and yeah, this freaking fan art, man. This freaking fan art. I mean, he even did my freaking sniper rifle. I mean, who the hell does that? And then C4 Duck came along and he actually improved the first fan art you saw. I mean, look at this. Just plops an Ainsley head on there. If you guys have any fan art that you want to submit, then be sure to hit me up on Discord and send it there. I will be featuring it all, if you have any, that is. Okay, let's just jump right into the video now. Alright, what's better one? Pathfinder here, and today we're playing some more uh, Killing Aflora 2, and today we are going to be maximizing the amount of dosh, world dosh thing I can get in one freaking match. So we're going to be playing the Bubble Z, which is like, repeated for like, I don't know, like 3 months now I guess, 4 months, and we're going to be completing this daily and this daily. And the Z landing I can't do because this weekly is on suicidal. So, we're just going to be playing today some casual nightmare with, I don't know, the sharpshooter, let's say. And yeah, let's just jump right in and see what we can do. Wait, do I have the wrong skills on? I have a feeling I do. Okay, don't. I mean, usually I would take this, but stability for the increased damage, it's just, like, way better, in my opinion. Okay, let's see what we can do here, man. Freaking nightmare with the bobble zed. A freaking small ass map with a huge amount of zeds. Okay, let's say this now. Clots. Oh, it's a one shot for him. Oh, this is just going to be too freaking easy, man. Oh my god. I, I heard a bunch of people like, complain that they can't be this weekly, but Jesus Christ. Oh, that gore fiend's tongue is all the freaking where. Oh, I just like how I can stun now. Okay, clots. I need my dosh, so can you please just cooperate and go? I mean, how is this weekly hard? It's like the easiest thing imaginable. I mean, even though they have like a whole lot of health now, but still. Okay, this freaking alpha clot has tremendous amount of health. But does that stop you from beating it? And not really. Oh my god, I'm just like not used to like crouching every single time. Okay, get frozen, now get demolished. Well, first round, piece of cake. Oh, we're in the spider room, nice. Wait, where's that huge ass spider? There he is. Freaking bullshit, man. Okay, skipping the trader and be right back. And here we go, second wave, and I changed into the gunslinger because I need damage with the desert eagles after all. Okay, where the hell are they even gonna spawn from? I don't even know where all the spawn points are in this map. Oh, a huge ass spider, never appreciated. I mean, the gunslinger, it's just like the perk to play for this kind of like weekly. Because their heads are just so freaking huge. Oh, and I apparently already did the daily objective. And I on only shot like, like what, like five bullets? I mean, those are like the weekly challenges for you. Okay, Claude, just get freaking molested, man. There we go, Gorfiend. Oh my god, like these weekly outbreaks and daily challenges, just like the easiest thing imaginable. Okay, well, skipping the trader and be right back. And we are back for another round. Let's see what we can do here. I also bought like another Desert Eagle, so this is going to be like 50% easier than the previous wave. Which says quite a lot. Okay, spider get freaking demolished, man. Those freaking elite spiders not gonna explode today because your heads are freaking huge. Okay, here we go. Gore fiend. Freak spiders, man. I mean, rack him up is just like so freaking useful on this. I mean, just look at this. They just get like demolished left and right. Even though they have like 
I know 100% more health on there. Heads. They still kinda easy to kill, I mean look at this. It's like a walk in the park. Even easier than that. Dude, I'm just like maximizing all the freaking money in the vault, but apparently the vault still doesn't work to, to this day. And that was apparently a scrake. Never saw anything easier in my life. So yeah, skipping the trader and B. And we are back for the fourth wave. Let's see what we can do here. I mean, just look at these skins. I just can't get over the fact that these skins actually exist. Fucking hell, they're good. Okay, let's see this now. 28 to kill. There is already like a bunch of them here. So can you please just get dismantled, man? Oh, I just like the freaking 1911s. They're just so freaking perfect. Demolished, bloat your next, don't even dare to block your head. Oh, that's right, When once he falls down, he can't even get up because he's too freaking fat. And he can't even support the weight of his own head, apparently. Okay, gore fiend, get bashed away, so I can kill, like, all the clots. Oh, and I'm out of the 1911s because reasons. Okay, gore fast dead, kill the other guy. Oh, there's the husk. Wait, does the husk actually have, like, more health on his, like, fuel tank or not? I mean, I'm not sure. We can test it out, right? Okay, husk, come on, do your worst. Oh, well, he's dead. Oh, he doesn't. That proves my theory. Okay, one shot wonder. Okay, missed. Okay, there's still, like, six left, so I have to be, like, j just a bit careful, you know, so I don't get, like, destroyed from the back. Okay, you're dead, gonna kill this guy. My god, I mean, the guy, the person who says that this weekly is hard, I mean, Jesus Christ, I could probably do this with like a level 0 on the Nightmare, like, over and over again, so yeah, skipping the trader and be right back. And we are back, only 31 to kill, let's go and see what we can do with this. I mean, if this weekly was like on Hell and Earth, then fair enough, but suicidal... Meh, it's just too freaking easy, man. Okay, let's kill you, get like all the rack em up on, because that's what you do in Killing Floor. I mean, this is just actually like satisfying, if nothing else, because just listen to this freaking rack em up skill going off. It's so freaking cool. I mean, this is kind of like headshot practice, but I don't really aim in this game, so no real practice for me. Okay, get fucked. There we go, gore fiends, stop blocking your head. Okay, the gore fiends blocking their heads are actually annoying in this. I will agree to that. But everything else, freaking easy. It's a flash pawn. But I actually wonder how the quarter pawns are gonna look like in this. Okay, destroyed. Oh, there he is. Oh, and that's a lot of other things right next to him. But since this is suicidal, they can't do jack shit. Oh yeah, if you shoot the flashbang, he doesn't even rage anymore because the reasons. Which he dead already. Okay, I don't think he is. Okay, there we go. Husks that Okay, how did I kill the flashbang if I didn't even shoot him? Well. That just proves how difficult this is. I mean, I know I'm like saying it's easy and shit, and for like a beginning player this is probably like unbeatable, but I mean I got like a thousand dollars in this, everything the chipwire pulls out, it's going to be freaking easy for me, but yeah. Skipping the trader and be right back. Oh, here we go, I'm already getting the same rooms I got in the previous... Previous waves, nice. Four different rooms, Jesus Christ. Alright, skipping the trader and be right back. And we are back, let's see what we can do here, man. I mean, if chipwire wants to make like a holdout style map... At least make 10 different rooms, so if you play like a long game, you can have like a different room each time. But since I'm playing like medium now, and I'm already getting the same freaking rooms. I mean, if I was playing like a long game, this would probably be like all the same rooms over and over again. I mean, three rooms are like always the same, just like the middle rooms are kind of like four of them, four different ones you can get, which is kind of like... A small amount of rooms, if you think about it. Okay, I think the Descent has like 10 different ones. Not entirely sure. Or does it have like 5 different ones? I think the Descent has more rooms like in general compared to this one. 
Oh, and that is a huge ass siren getting destroyed. Okay, come on, Gorfin, stop blocking your heads. Because you are not appreciated in the slightest. My god, there's just so freaking many of them. And the only challenging part here is killing these Gorfins that like to block their heads every single freaking time. Okay, Husk, shoot, man. He doesn't even want to shoot. Okay, there we go. Oh, I killed five bloats. Nice. Now I just only need to complete this and I should be good to go on the Dosh Vault crate thing. Okay, let's see this. Now what's left? Freaking Scrake, man. I just kill him with the 19 freaking 11s. I mean, this is what I mean compared to like the Hemogoblin. The freaking Gunslinger can just like slow Zeds down. So there is no real use for the Hemogoblin. Okay, well, here we go. Second to last room. So yeah, skipping the trader and be right back. And we are back. And the clown doesn't agree with life, apparently. Okay, let's just kill these, like, 37 of them. And then we should be good to freaking go. Okay, I'm actually wondering what's on this. Okay. Apparently this guy doesn't like puking the clown. The bloat. Oh, well, that's a whole lot of spiders that no one appreciates. Let's just use these bad boys. Because they are quite freaking powerful if you have, like, five rack mops on. I mean, even the Gorfin doesn't even know what to do anymore. Shows how powerful the freaking Gunslinger actually is. Oh my god, these Magnums are just so freaking good. I wish there was like a neon skin for like the magnums, now that would be something freaking cool. But I'm not like even trying here, I'm just like casually playing and they're still freaking dying left and right. The hardest weekly out there, man. Freaking bobble Zed. Wait, what's even the reward for this? I think it's like that golden thing. The golden helmet, right? If I'm not mistaken. Well, 15 minutes of... Pure easiness. So yeah, skipping the trader and be right back. And we are back for the boss. Let's see who we're gonna get. I'm hoping for like a King Fleshbone, but nope, I get huge head hunts. Nice. Oh, there he is. I can see him like a mile away. Oh, I already got five headshots on him. Nice. Freaking 1911's OP. And I even have like resistance to his stupid bullets. Oh, you already on your face, Hans. What the hell are you doing there? Oh, well, he's dead. Let's kill him again. There we go. Freaking spiders. Oh, why do they want to punch me, man? That doesn't make jack shit for sense. Okay, let's kill this guy. Kill Hans in the meantime. Come on, Hans. You got this. I, I don't think he actually has this. Yep. Hardest weekly ever, man. Hardest weekly ever. Okay, let's just reload this thing and just kill him with the magnums. And he is demolished, well, it only took me like less than a minute probably on the boss. Finally, some Halloween tickets. Alright, see you at the vault. Okay, moment of freaking truth. Give me some awesome ass spicy stuff. Did I even rank up? Oh, I did. Oh, it gave me like a lot of freaking money. Hey, would you look at that? I actually got myself a freaking vault crate. Alright, let's see what we get. Please give me something decent now, because I already got scammed like two crates. And of course you're gonna give me freaking glasses. Fucking hell. Wait, do I get like more? Okay, don't. My god. Well, let's see how the glasses look like. Probably like jack shit. Yeah, pretty much. Dude, I just want the freaking... What's it called? I just want the Strasser's suit, but nah, the Doshwald does not want to give me the suit. Okay, well I already got three stacks on this and a small little pile over here and I still need to do the daily... Wait, what is it? Freaking Z landing on Hell on Earth. So yeah, I'm gonna do that and yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Leave a like, subscribe and see you guys next episode. Adios.